Welcome back to a new tutorial from Connect. In this video you're going to learn how to create a fuzziness effect for your game, exactly like the one you're seeing in the background, with simple steps and from scratch. The only tools that you need are Unity, built-in or URP version and Beautify 2, and then you're ready to go. Before starting this tutorial, I have set up a simple scene with simple behavior to give you a more realistic impression to this effect. Once you're ready to start and Beautify is correctly added to your scene, the first thing you'll have to do is locate the blur and blink effect. Both features are included with the asset and the correct animation of these two features is going to be the result we're looking for. Open Unity's animation window, select the camera and with the camera selected create a new animation and save it on your preferred location inside the project. Now you can hit the record button and then create the first keyframe with the blur effect activated. You only need to move a tiny bit the value in order to create the first frame. Now move the timeline to another point and decrease the blur value to zero. Don't worry about the time at the moment, we will tweak this value at the end. The next step will be to create frames for the blink effect. Start with the first keyframe with the eye closed and create the following one with the eye almost opened. Keep in mind that we are trying to reproduce a comeback from a deep sleep. Do the same process until you have around 4 blinks, meaning you will have a total of 8 frames. Now that everything is set, it's time to adjust the frames in order to mimic the velocity at which the blink and blurriness should be reproduced. This is a subjective job, and in my case, I adjusted everything to be reproduced in the range of around 15 seconds, making the blurriness fade a few seconds before ending the whole animation. This is it, you achieved the fuzziness effect in a few simple steps, and now your game has a new realistic look to it. Thank you for watching the video, and remember to follow us for more educational content.